everybody's favorite bad guy, Ty. Feeling a little bit better now. A little bit. I'm still kind of eh, but hey, I'm here. This is, oh, damn, Superman. Super, oh, damn, Superman, HBK. Yes, Heartbreak Kid. Shawn Michaels, yes. It's given to me by The Blind Chronicles on YouTube. My One of my best buddies, Rye. It's sitting right there. I don't know if you can see that, Rye. I don't know if you're watching, but I hope you are. Oh. Okay. Answer portion to the last Q&A. Everything's falling over the place here. Give myself a nice fresh cup. Shut the hell up. And uh, let's get into it. <laughs> ah. Okay. I'm going to pull up my little notepad, note, whatever the hell here on my computer, and let's get into it. All right. Just doing some clicking around, guys. Hang on. Hang on. There we go. <laughs> I only got three questions from two people, but that's okay. That's what this is for. Nice and quick, nice and easy. Hey, cheers. Pinkies out. And all that fun stuff. Two people I love a whole lot. Um, they didn't request that they like to remain anonymous, so I will name them. Uh, two of my regulars on this channel. One that's actually been here. The other one waiting to be here. But um, Or me there, whatever. Don't matter. I know I sound like a selfish lover, but I'm not. So, okay. Let's do it. So this question comes in from... Oh, I love this question. It's this... I don't expect anybody else to get this this question, and I don't think there's really an answer to it. It's more of an answer question. See, I'm rambling again. Damn, that's all right. Okay, this comes in from a Walsh in the Woods on YouTube, one of my best friends in the entire world, Mr. Patty McPat Pat, Pat Patty McPat Pat Walsh. That's a Walsh in the Woods. W A L S H. <laughs> We've had this ongoing thing. I'm not even going to explain the backstory because I don't think he wants me to explain it. It's just one of those things where we're just going to keep it as is. The question is, in quotations, but the question is, dot, 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 do you like vanilla? End quotation. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just wish he was sitting like right here right now, man. Uh, I've always loved that question. It's one of those had to be there moments. And at the same time, I will explain this part. <laughs> Patty came up with, but the question is, and at the same time, we both said, do you like vanilla at the very same time? It's one of those deals. He's been an old buddy of mine for, what year is it, Patty, when we met? Anyway, do you know? Because I can't remember. I know it was back in, hmm, I'm going to start dating that stupid thing. Um, no, just a little bit before that, wasn't it? I, whew, 2001? 2000? 99? Because I remember meeting up with you and we were both playing in bands and stuff and doing the thing. And... Anyways, this is one of the questions that always stuck out. I'm so glad he put that there. No, I'm pretty sure you said it in one of our vlogs when you were sitting here. I'm pretty sure you did say that. Anyway, comment down below because... My memory's not that great these days since I'm getting all old and decrepit and everything. Hey, jeez, kid! Right? <laughs> Thanks, Patty. Love you, buddy. Go check out his channel, A Walsh in the Woods. It's right there on YouTube. There's a lot of cool stuff on his channel, too. Anyway, tell him I sent you. All right. The next two questions comes in from the same bloody guy. Also another person I love to death. Um, never met him in person, but he has been in one of my videos before in telephone mode. In one of these little jobbies. One of these. Flavio Di Giovanni. Flabby Flav. That's right. You know, go check out his channel. Toronto Fire. All uppercase. Two different words. Toronto Fire. If you don't know how to spell those words, I can't help you. Anyway, so cool, well, cool stuff on his channel, too, man. Actually, I really enjoy it. I remember, um, actually, I did it last week. I went back and I watched a bunch of your stuff. And uh, the old days of T-Dot Heat, too. Hi, Danny. I know. Hello. Um, love you, too, buddy. Uh, 
check out t.heat at the same time. Again, two different words, t.heat, all uppercase, t. It's all smashed together. Um, good fellas, man. They've, they've been supporters of me and this channel. I mean, I barely even call this a channel. It's just a place where I collect my thoughts and bitch at a camera. So, uh, thanks for the questions. Um, <laughs> you dirty prick. <laughs> I'll get to the more serious one first. Um, Flav, he asked, why haven't you shown your girl on the videos? He's referring to Lisa, my girlfriend. She's right next door, lol. Yeah, typically, um, I'll explain some of that. And it's kind of funny, Flav, I gotta talk to you privately about that because something might be coming up here pretty soon, hopefully. Um, message me, man. Let me know. Uh, message me on Facebook. But, um, usually Lisa hates not only being around people, and I know that sounds kind of funny, but I totally get it. It's the smart way because people piss her off. So, not that she's too introverted, but, you know, she ha she's very selective of who, you know, especially comes over here and, you know, we hang out and stuff. And so am I because I'm always at work. So, I'm not just going to let any regular Joe hang out, you know what I mean? Um, <laughs> she's very selective that way, but she's also very camera shy. Um, which is also pretty smart because it keeps her safe. And, you know, her hands made an appearance one time. That was cool. Yeah. Anyway, so. <laughs> seriously, though. Mm -hmm. Her hands made an appearance, but, um, you know, you could hear her voice in the background. And I've actually gotten a lot of comments and stuff like that. That is she really real? Like, did you make her up? Ah, uh, you can't make Elisa up. That's for damn sure. You know. And uh, side note, flat right back to you. What about Angela? How come she's not going to come on camera? Huh? Huh? Lisa showed her hand. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Anyway, um, probably for the same reason. No, it's good. Uh, just to keep her safe and all that stuff. But you never know. Never say never. You never know. It might be coming up soon. You never know. Uh, she's going to beat me up if I ask her, because she's like, you want me to do what? No! And then whack! So, but just purely for your entertainment, I hope I catch that on camera. <sighs> so anyway, that answers that. Um, yeah, it's, that's so true, too, Flav. She's like right around the corner. She's right down the hallway, right in that room that you saw me vlog from before. And the blue lights and all that. She usually sits right there, just shaking her head, going, why is he doing such stupid-ass bullshit? What the hell? And, you know, that's so right. Eh, it's all right. It's my thing. She's a very respectable person. She's very loving, very caring, very sweet. Very sweet. The hell is she doing with me? I don't know. Maybe that's another question for another time. Um, but, yeah, so she, you know, she tries to stay off camera and, all that stuff, you know, but she'll laugh or she'll, you know, throw a quick comment here and there. Or she'll be sitting right next to me and she'll, you know, throw in her hand and, you know, just to be funny. Um, but to see her face on camera, you might be waiting a little while. <laughs> so that answers that one. Now for the next one, your, your next question, Flav. I don't know, man. It's kind of semi-appropriate, semi-not. But here in this channel, you know what we do. We do it anyway. <laughs> Flavio once again asks, Have you ever been caught by any of your parents spread eagle rubbing one out? Really, Flav? Asking this from personal experience, are you? The answer is no. There's a reason why I'm so uptight, I think, in this, these days, today's days, is because I don't really have the chance to rub one out, I guess. You sick, twisted freak. I love you to death for it. I do. You know, just goes to show you, though. No, I can honestly say. Um, that nobody's really ever caught me doing much of anything other than what I'm supposed to be doing, you know. And if you're going to rub one out, I mean, what are you talking about? Like rubbing out a stain from a stained glass window 
Are we talking about nicotine stains? Do I smoke indoors off the walls? I mean, what, what are you talking about? Look, if you're into choking chickens, hey, that's cool. I, I, I don't judge you. I just won't shake your hand. If I go in for a hug and I feel... We'll just leave it right there. It's the hair, isn't it? It's the hair. Yeah. Ah, uh, thanks for the other question. Wow. Uh, no. The answer is no. That'll conclude today's answered portion to my last Q and A vlog. Thank you for the questions. And um, remember. If you're working too hard, or rubbing one out too hard, you're doing it wrong. Bad guy. Everybody's favorite bad guy. Now I feel like going to have a chicken sandwich or something. Why? What the hell? Lisa, are you out there? Oh no, she's still at work. Did I say you're doing it wrong? You're doing it wrong. Bad guy. Out. See you in the next one. Love you. <laughs> Good questions, guys. Thank you. Cheers. Bye.